I just went to turn my camera on and got very distracted by this little squirrel outside the window. <sighs> okay. Yeah. I was just zoomed in because I'm awesome. Okay. It's Monday. Welcome to Five Girls Five Minutes. I'm Sarah. And sorry for zooming in on my face for a second there. Um, so Thanksgiving just happened, and how was your Thanksgiving? Mine was nice. Um, we mostly had very amusing conversations while we eat. Um, I'm vegetarian, so I don't eat the turkey, but I we have a lot of sides, so I, I eat pretty much all of the different types of sides available. My favorite is the uh, sweet potato casserole that my mom makes. It's it's a southern thing, I think, and it's really sweet and delicious, and I love it. And I like the stuffing, and sometimes the stuffing gets mixed in with the sweet potato sweet goodness stuff and makes the stuffing even better. But yeah, so there's that, and uh, not very many of us made videos last week, but I know it's because Tara was still waiting to get her camera working, and then she went away, so, um, and Itzel was probably busy with Thanksgiving because it was the day before Thanksgiving. Everybody was probably busy with Thanksgiving. Um, Libby was working on Black Friday, so I'm looking forward to hearing your Black Friday story because I think that that would be a very unique perspective because I don't know too many people who have worked on Black Friday. I just know people who've shopped on Black Friday. So I want to hear the perspective of the uh, person working in the store, not shopping. Um, I didn't go out for Black Friday, I usually don't. We went out on Saturday and kind of went to local businesses. So it was like a local business Saturday, and then we went and saw the Muppet movie, which was awesome. And uh, according to Brett, they're planning to try to make a, a Flight of the Concords movie. I almost said Muppet movie. They already did that. Um, but yeah, Flight of the Concords movie would be awesome. I posted that on my Facebook, and a bunch of people were like, yay! Um, commenting, or not commenting, liking it, because it's big. I hope that they really do it, because that would be awesome. And, um, so, I finished my NaNoWriMo. I have 50,533 words, according to the thing. I was trying, I had a palindrome, and it was perfect, because it was, uh, 50,505, so it looked really cool, but then I put it into, um, like, make sure that I had the right amount of words to verify it, and then now I have 50,533, which is more words, so I shouldn't be upset, but now I don't have a pretty palindrome, so I think I'm going to keep writing, because you can. I'm going to keep writing until I have a palindrome again, and that'll be my final thing. I'm almost done, and uh, if I have enough time, which I kind of do, squirrel, squirrel interrupted, <laughs> starring Winona Ryder. Right um, okay, I laughed loudly, unable to contain my excitement. You've seen him? A few of the men around us made shushing sounds, but I did not care. Kurt was alive. I think so, Leo replied in a whisper. In the dim light provided by the moon, I could see that he was smiling. I remember a young man of your description, and he spoke often of his friends back home in Warsaw. Oh, that must be him. I'm sure of it. I was just again, and I shook my head. I felt like laughing loudly and for a long time, not caring how many people heard me. Hope was restored to me by this man. I took Leo's hand and kissed the back of it. Thank you. You have no idea how much you've helped me already. He nodded, smiling still and looking into my eyes. This is, that is what friends are for, and friends are really needed in a place like this. Greatly needed in a place like this. I can't read. Um, but yeah, that's that's a little bit about Leo, which is inspired by um, one of Tara's friends, Leo. Her real name's Carly, but she has to be a character in the story, so I made her be this really, really nice character that they meet later on in the story. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I'm going to keep writing so I have a lot of words for the end of the month, and also so I finish it with a nice, pretty palindrome word count, because I don't care about the verification thing saying I have more. I think it's just contractions. I use a lot of contractions, like can't and stuff. I try not to, but, but I guess it counts as more than one word, because I don't know how else I suddenly have more words. But anyway, I hope you're all having an awesome month. I don't really have any questions. I was racking my brain trying to think of a question. Nobody really answered my Muppet question last week, because nobody made a video, so which Muppet character is your favorite? Answer it, because I care. And <laughs> Tara, I really hope I see you tomorrow. I hope you got your thingy, and I hope it works. And everybody else, I will see you later. And I hope you are enjoying your month. <laughs> Bye.